you have the uh, calling of the twelve disciples? Yes, yeah, go ahead. Okay, great. So after he was done teaching, Jesus went up the mountain to pray in the evening, and he prayed all through the night. In the morning, he came back down to select his twelve disciples. He chose uh, Simon, who he renamed Peter, and his brother Andrew, James and John, the sons of Zebedee. They were also known as the sons of Thunder. He chose uh, Matthew, a tax collector, uh, another James, history knows him as James the Less, Simon the Zealot, Thaddeus, who was also known as Judas, but he wasn't the Judas who betrayed Jesus. And there was Judas Iscariot. There are a couple more whose names I cannot recall, but there are 12. Um, after Jesus called the disciples, he told them, well, he gave them the power, first of all, to teach and to cast out evil spirits, and they were going to be with him so he could continue to teach them how to do that. Um, but after he called them, he told them, I am sending you out like wolves among sheep. You need to be as true as snakes and as innocent as doves. The world will hate you because they hated me first. But do not be afraid because the Father, he knows when the sparrow falls, how much more does he care for you? He even knows how many hairs are on your head. Your family will want you to choose them over me. Those who do this are not worthy to be my disciples. You must take up your cross and bear my shame. And those who find their life in this world will lose it. And those who lose their life in me will find it. Good job.